What's up guys, it's your girl, Nicole Young. Welcome back to the channel. And if you're new here, welcome. This is gonna be a good one. So I know that a lot of people in this community and a lot of people that find my channel are those of you who are looking to break into tech. And right now has been a really weird time for those of us who are trying to do that because of the tech layoffs and new technology like AI popping up all of the time it can kind of feel like maybe it's too late, maybe it's too saturated to actually break into tech and build a thriving career here. I'm here to tell you it's not, but you definitely have to be way more strategic than I was when I was trying to do the same thing about five years ago. Because tech, in general as an industry is becoming more popular and it's becoming more socially acceptable in the industry to bring people in who don't have that formal education or a college degree in some type of technical background. I do see that there's tons more resources than there ever was when I was trying to break into tech about five years ago. But one thing I am noticing is that not all courses are created equally. So I have created a few videos in the past on my personal experiences taking courses and the ones that I've liked and didn't like and have given very honest reviews. So if you are interested in actually seeing the ones I took to break into tech, definitely go ahead and check those out. But if you bumped into me today in the coffee shop and you asked me what I recommend to people trying to break into tech, right now, these are the five online courses that I would suggest to anyone looking to make a career switch, especially a lot quicker than I did. This video is different from some of the previous ones that I made because I have not taken every single one of these courses, but I have dug deep into my resource to be able to refer to people because I get this question a lot and I wanted to be able to make sure I was recommending resources that I would take myself if I was to go back and learn technical skills to break into tech right now. So these are ones that I have vetted myself. I still recommend that you use the links that I've left in the description to check each one of them out yourself, but I'm going to go through each one of them and share with you why I would recommend it. So the first one I'm going to recommend is Skill Crush. If you are looking to learn front-end development or UX UI design, this is the number one resource that I would recommend to you. Skill Crush was actually the first course that I invested in when I decided to take my career switch into tech seriously. And I took the front-end development career track and then went back and did a little bit of the design courses as well. What I love about Skill Crush is how interactive the courses are and they're broken down so that no matter what level of experience you have, you're going to walk away with a deeper understanding of the technology and why things are the way they are. What's also great about them is how much support you're going to have throughout your process at Skill Crush. They have a Slack channel that's open to you throughout your time taking the course where you can ask questions and get feedback on the things that you're doing. They also have mentorship structure, something that I love that they do now that was not available when I took the course originally was now they have the break into tech package that comes with a job guarantee option. That wasn't available when I took it, but it was worth the investment back then, and it's even more so worth the investment now that they have that job guarantee. The next one that I would recommend is Udacity. They have loads of options in development and programming, cloud architecture, product management, business, and artificial intelligence, to name a few. I love how their lessons are broken down into what is called nano degrees. So whether you are someone trying to break into tech for the first time or looking to upskill in some way to add to what skills that you already have, this is a great option for you because you'll be able to pick and choose uh, one nano degree or a few to kind of build up the skill set that you want. Before we dig into the next three, I want to just mention quickly that with 
any of the courses that you're going to take, any new learning, especially within technical skills that you're going to do, it's likely that you'll be downloading new applications and software and visiting new websites that you might not be familiar with. And with all of that, it is so, so important to make sure you are protecting yourself online. The way that I do that personally is through the sponsor of today's video, which is Webroot. Webroot is an award-winning antivirus software which has partnered with Allstate Identity Protection to provide you with the peace of mind that you deserve. With Webroot Premium, you will have antivirus protection against emerging threats for up to five devices, a password manager, plus a system optimizer to clean your devices and erase traces of online activity. If you buy it now, you'll save 40% off for a limited time. With Allstate Identity Protection, you get credit, dark web, identity, and financial monitoring with proactive alerts on threats to your identity. Use the link in the description for more info and to get 40% off your Webroot Premium account. The next thing I would recommend is Course Careers. Now, I've never mentioned this one on this channel before, but I have, actually my younger brother just recently finished Course Careers coursework, and I will definitely be recommending it to anyone who's looking to break into tech through tech sales. If you are coming from a sales background, and this could be in anything, I think that doing Course Careers will really help you to build the foundation that you need on top of your current sales experience to understand how tech sales works, how it might differ from previous sales experience you might have, and be able to get your foot in the door to build a new career in tech sales. It's completely self-paced. They're not only going to teach you the kind of skill sets that you need, but they're also going to give you the skills you need to learn how to stand out on LinkedIn and how to interview, how to negotiate. And I thought that was really cool hearing from my brother's experience. So I definitely think if you kind of want that foundational knowledge to kind of just make a little pivot from a different type of sales background or something adjacent to sales into tech sales specifically, I think I will definitely be bringing up course careers to more people as they ask for ways to break into tech. The next one is Yellowtail Tech. This is also a newer one that I've been mentioning on my channel. What sets Yellowtail Tech apart is the fact that the career paths that they focus on are the Linux system admin and the AWS cloud DevOps engineer option. Now, to break this down for you guys a little bit, AWS is the most popular web service for that type of cloud architecture that most businesses you will find built on top of. Even the company I work for is built on top of AWS. And if you are looking for a career with longevity and job security that you can really grow a thriving career around, I think learning a skill set around the Amazon Web Services platform is the way to do it. So not only are you going to learn everything you need to learn in either Linux system admin or as a cloud DevOps engineer, you're also going to be guaranteed to land a job within six to nine months of graduating the program. They're going to give you all the support you need and if you're interested in learning more or checking it out, you can use the link in the description right now to go and talk to a real person in a 10 minute introductory call, which I think is really nice to have that personal touch where you can have your questions answered and talk to a real person to get in the know of what that program's about. Last but not least, this is one I've mentioned in other videos before is Careerist. Careerist has options for quality assurance, sales and system engineering, and even UX design. And what's great about Careerist is that you don't need any coding or tech experience in order to break into tech and land a high paying job through their courses. What I think sets Careerist apart and why I have been recommending it to more people is because not only do they have a 100% money back guarantee if you do not land a job within a year after graduating the program? 
their average graduate lands a job within two to four months, which is much faster than a lot of boot camps and other programs offer. And they also land higher paying jobs than what the average is for a lot of the boot camps and things that are out there right now. So the average that I seen was 69,000 to 105,000 on their first jobs after finishing the program. So they're doing something right. So definitely check them out. The link to all five of these platforms is down in the description of this video. So make sure you check each one of them out and figure out which one is right for you if you're still looking. As always guys, I love you. I'm rooting for you. I can't wait to see you in the next one.